The grassroots donation drive has been a huge hit in Syracuse, thanks to many of you. We first told you about Matt Govendo, who was asking for donations for youth baseball in the city of Syracuse last week. Yeah, I think you could call this story a home run. <laughs> I think like that. that. Grand slam, even. Well, Matt Govendo's had overwhelming support from our community, thanks to your help. News Channel Line's Josh Martin catching back up with Matt Govendo, who needs a whole team now to help him get these donations out. Matt Cavendo has more stock than a sporting goods store. In just a few days since we last spoke, donations have doubled, tripled, and now a grand slam of gifts have taken over his garage. After seeing our story last week, people came from across central New York to help get kids in the game. I mean, I knew people would help and they want to chip in, but the, the support from Everybody has just been amazing. I, I had one lady um, drive from Rome, buy new stuff, dropped it off, and said thank you for doing this. It's, it's just amazing, amazing. This all started with a short video on Twitter. Now, it's more like a major league operation. He says there's hundreds of baseball cleats, pants, balls, belts, and bags in here, as well as dozens of gloves and bats for the kids. You guys are doing a great job. While cleaning up and disinfecting the gear, Govendo's team of sons, neighbors, and friends have stepped up to sort out everything. All you see here will go to kids of all ages in Syracuse. The rest will go to whoever needs it. Then maybe, just maybe, Govendo will get his garage back. In Cicero, Josh Martin, News Channel 9. Sure he doesn't mind. Govendo says he was inspired by what former SU hoops great Eric Devendorf did for businesses in central New York recently, raising money for places struggling because of the pandemic. And partners like the most downtown and so many other drop-off sites made this a real team effort.